I'm Joe Annis, A-N-N-I-S. Uh, I'm a member of the Board of Trustees of the American Medical Association. Well, we were invited to um, give the opening keynote speech in the one of the four venues that's related to health care reform and the health care reform legislation, how to implement it, the good parts of it, the problems with it, the things that might be have to be changed. Um, basically, um, in my short remarks, I want to sort of give an overview, but also let people know that there are some good things in this legislation, but there are also some things that are troublesome, things that are going to be, uh, we think, a problem that need to be fixed. And there are certain things that are missing, too, that we think need to be added down the line. The way that physicians are paid by Medicare needs to be fixed. Everybody agrees it's broken. It was created by Congress uh, in 1997, this current program, and it's broken. It's not working. Everybody agrees, but Congress won't fix it. That's one of the things that needs to be fixed. Another thing, if you'd like to know more, is there's no tort reform in this health care bill. And if we're trying to reduce expenses, you need to have tort reform. Uh, the only conference uh, that I'm going to be attending today is the one uh, having to do with health care reform. Um, but uh, that's going to be the, the overarching area that's going to be changing in this country. The things over the next four years, this health care reform bill will have vast changes. Um, and uh, the implementation of this bill and some of the problems with the, this bill are going to be discussed in this conference today. Well, it's an interesting que the question about uh, health care tourism. Um, we know that international health care tourism has been going on and gradually increasing where people leave this country to go to other countries uh, because it's less expensive. Uh, interestingly enough, within the United States now, there's sort of an internal health care tourism with companies that will basically have an agreement with a major medical center regarding certain types of care and all of their employees that need care that are covered by the country by that company will actually go to this one health care um, facility for their care, which is a very interesting concept. And I'm really looking forward to listening and hearing more about it. Well, listening and learning, and uh, as I mentioned earlier, one of my expectations is in my opening remarks is to try to give an overview of what really is, are the good things and what are the things that need to be corrected uh, as far as the health care reform legislation is concerned.